Welcome to Rectory's Glimpses into the Classroom video series. These episodes each showcase a unique and tangible demonstration of Rectory's dynamic curriculum. Join me now as we visit Mrs. Zahansky's fourth grade classroom, where students combine their knowledge of geography and coding to create interactive maps of the United States. Hi, I'm Melissa Zahansky. I teach fourth grade at the Rectory School. Hi, I'm Carson. I'm in the fourth grade. I'm Maxton in the fourth grade. Hi, I'm Peter. Hi, my name is Brody. I'm Henry, and I'm in Mrs. Zahansky's fourth grade class. The children in my class were working on the culmination of all of their learning from the term. We integrate all aspects of the curriculum for the final project so they can apply everything that they've learned in each domain. In social studies, we were working on the southeast region. We took some poster board and Ms. Hansky traced our states onto it. Then we cut a little square into the poster board where our state is. Each child had to choose a state and become an expert on that state. I did Florida. My state is Kentucky. I had North Carolina. I had Virginia. I did South Carolina, the Palmetto State. They then took that information, then record all of that information, and combined it with our science unit, which is circuits and pathways. We are going to connect this electric tape that is going to go to like a hole that she cut, and it's going to make a little pathway. We connect all of our wires to the Makey Makey. Makey Makey is a circuit board that allows things that usually are not interactive to be interactive. A two-dimensional map can become an interactive map. We incorporated the circuits and pathways piece because they had to wire each state through the Makey Makey to complete the circuit to get the interactive piece of the map that will talk to you. Makey Makey we use in conjunction with Scratch. This website called Scratch it's basically coding, which is basically just programming, but simplified. Scratch is a beginning coding program developed by MIT. I work in collaboration with Mr. Finnegan, who is their media teacher. Hi, my name is Ryan Finnegan, and I teach the fourth grade media class at the Rectory School. But what we do is we teach the kids how to make different games, different functions. This is a great opportunity to collaborate with Melissa and use this in her history lesson. We record this thing on this program called Scratch. The copper tape conducts, so when you tap it, it completes the circuit and it plays the sound that we recorded on Scratch. Welcome to West Virginia, the Mountain State, state capital of Charleston. Many of the children choose a song. Georgia. Georgia. Or a famous recipe or a saying or a slogan or a speech. We found some interesting places, interesting facts. They really kind of make the state and the project their own. She really let us do a lot of stuff by ourselves. She gave us the instructions and we did it. It was lots of fun. Every time I go into that fourth grade, it's like, are we doing Scratch today? Or when I can say we're doing Scratch today, they're like, yes, we're doing this. So it warms my heart every time I go into the classroom and see them really excited. Every day, they know that when they walk into my classroom that their job is to kind of create their own learning that day. I'm looking for them to take it beyond the basic requirements. A lot of days we're doing something that's unusual. So basically, unusual is usual. The broad lesson with an integrated curriculum is real world application. How do I apply this to my next class? How do I apply this to my life? How do I apply this to a scenario that I'm in that maybe isn't in an educational setting? I just like working together with everyone in my class. I like working with her because she lets us work together and collaborate. It's fun having her because we do a lot of projects. I'm surprised every day. Every time I go into that classroom, it's a different lesson. What I don't know, they're teaching me. They will get the concept and they'll go further with it. I think that's where their mind is and that's the way they think. So you have to just jump on board and let them go with it. To learn more about Rectory's curriculum, visit the academic program section of our school website.